Good morning, Joe Marshall. I'm Carson Ebert. And I'm Mrs. Kuski. Here are the morning announcements for Friday, November 5th, 2021. Alpha Omega Epsilon presents Junior Academy, a virtual four-week program for high school girls. During the program, attendees will experience hands-on activities, lab tours, and keynote speakers from various STEM fields with a focus on engineering and women in STEM. The event will take place on November 8th, 15th, and 29th, and on December 2nd from 6 to 7 p.m. For more information on the event, you can scan your QR code on your screen. For updates about the activities and event speakers, or to ask any questions, please email aoeoutreachwvu at gmail.com. Congratulations, class of 2023. You did an awesome job with your pie sales. Over 700 pies were sold. The order will be delivered to JMHS on Wednesday, November 10th. Pies are available for pickup after 10.30 a.m. that day. For more information about the specific location for pickup will be provided. Pies must be picked up on Wednesday, November 10th. There is it no room to store extra pies. Please contact Mrs. Walton and Mrs. Yates with any questions. There will be a meeting for anyone interested in playing boys lacrosse this spring. If you are interested in playing, please attend the meeting, which will be held on Monday, November 8th, at 6 p.m. in the JM Main Commons. There will be a tailgate tonight at 6 p.m. before the football game. All students are welcome and food will be provided. The theme for this week's game is Christmas in November. The yearbook fundraiser will end this week. All forms and orders are due to Mrs. Holiday today. The Trading Card Game Club will be holding a Magic Commander tournament Wednesday, November 10th after school in room 374. A $5 entry fee is required and must be paid when you sign up. The last day to enter is November 8th. Pizza and pop will be provided. If you have any questions or wish to sign up, please see Mrs. Will. This week is College Application Week and the Counseling Department is hosting events each day. Today is the final day for events and there will be a taco bar for any senior with a ticket. To receive a ticket, visit the Counseling Office. Anytime Fitness and Mounds will be offering a student-only strength and conditioning program. During this program, students will learn proper training techniques as well as how to strengthen training can benefit long-term health. The program will be held every Tuesday and Thursday from 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. beginning November 9th. It will cost $16 a week and will be led by a certified professional trainer. Students must be 16 years of age or older and must be enrolled by a legal guardian. A gym membership is not required. Sign-ups will begin on November 1st and run through November 8th. You can contact Anytime Fitness by calling them at 304-810-0454. Applications for National Honor Society are now available. Any junior or senior student with a 3.5 GPA is eligible to apply. Applications can be picked up in Mrs. Bandy's room in 313 or Mrs. Petrie in the counseling office. Completed applications are due to Mrs. Bandy or Mrs. Petrie by Wednesday, November 10th. West Virginia Northern Community College will be hosting an open house tomorrow, Saturday, November 6th from 9 a.m. to noon. Prospective students in attendance will be able to tour the campus, meet faculty and staff, get information about students' life and receive educational support. If you can't make it in person, you can also join a Zoom version of the open house. One person in attendance or online will win a $1,000 scholarship. For more information, you can call 304-214-8838 or visit wvncc.edu. 
Multiple colleges and military branches will be setting up during lunches in the senior commons in the near future. This includes Wittenberg University on Friday, November 12th, and Bella Capelli Academy on Wednesday, December 1st. If you are interested in speaking with any of these representatives, please make plans to meet with them on their respective dates. PAC is holding a winter clothing drive. The club will be accepting gently or used new coats, hats, blankets, hoodies, gloves, sweatpants for the event. Donations will be accepted now through November 12th. Boxes will be located throughout the school for students or faculty to donate. Now let's take a look at this weekend's events. The varsity football team will play tonight at Monarch Stadium. The game against rival Wheeling Park will kick off at 7 p.m. Tomorrow, the varsity, varsity volleyball team will participate in the Region 1 tournament. The match will begin at 2 p.m. at Monarch Field House. Also on Saturday, the girls varsity cheer squad will participate in the regional tournament. The competition will take place at Brook High School and will begin at 6 p.m. For a complete list of this week's events, check out the athletics tab of the John Marshall High School website. Thank you for listening to the morning announcements. I'm Carson Ebert. And I'm Mrs. Kuski. Have a great day, Monarchs.